Hello, today I am talking about my five favorite exercises. These are exercises that are excellent for building muscle mobility, good for progressions for other movements, and good cardio too, depending. So let's just get right into it. Number one, squat. There are lots of different variations of squats. They are working like pretty much every muscle in your legs, also your glutes. Um, a lot of people think that they're a great butt exercise, but really they're very quad dependent. And yeah, so there's like a sumo squat, there's goblet squat, there's like your standard one where you work on like getting good depth and squats are just awesome. They're great for building power, building muscle that will help you with exercises like wall balls and cleans and snatches and everything. They're just really good. Number two, deadlift. Deadlift is going to be awesome for what we're going to call pulling muscles. Again, uh, something that's really, really good for power. It's also pretty good for flexibility in your hamstrings. It's good as a progression for movements like the clean and jerk and snatch, like I just talked about. And that's because you're using all those muscles like your traps and your delts to pull the bar off the ground with as much power and intensity as you can so that you can get underneath it. Number three, shoulder press. Shoulder press, for me, for a long time has been very difficult. Like, and that's how I know that it's a good one and it's something to work on. So all heads your deltoid, your scat muscles are all going to be worked and again it is good progression for any shoulder to overhead movement and it's building like real strength and if you're wondering about like aesthetics and by the way I'm talking about like very standard shoulder press with no momentum in it. A strict press. Slow, painful, <laughs> hard. If you are actually interested in aesthetics rather than just athletic performance, it is a great, great tool to help you build that, let's say, V physique where you have larger, broader shoulders and then the rest of your body tapers down. Number four, Tota Bar. Tota Bar is a gymnastics movement in CrossFit where you are hanging from a bar, not passively, like your shoulders are very engaged and your neck is up, um, and then you are taking literally your toes to the bar. So it is extremely hard on your abs, like, holy smokes. Especially if you're doing strict toe to bar, again, no momentum, no kip. Like all of your abdominals, like upper, lower, everything, bringing your legs up. Uh, abdominals are worked more bringing your legs to you rather than bringing your upper body to you and by to you I mean like the center so if you're doing crunches yeah that's fine and great and all but really the purpose of abs as a muscle group is to bring your legs up so if you're thinking of muscles in their actual context you're gonna be working them more and building them better doing what they're meant to do so bring your legs upwards so, toe to bar, bring your legs up, pretty hardcore. Also, you're going to be working on flexibility, specifically in your hamstrings. And because it is not a passive hold, you're not just like sinking into your shoulders holding up there, it's going to be keeping your whole back engaged, your traps, your delts, definitely your lats. It's definitely a hardcore exercise, especially when you're doing it slow. All right, number five, one of my favorite things, and you're going to think I'm lying, burpees. Uh, I actually appreciate a good burpee. Burpees are excellent for building cardio and also pretty good on like delts and, ab and abs too because you're um, hopping down, you're using your shoulders and arms, your biceps, triceps to um, kick your body back. You're using your abs to hold like a firm plank, pushing down, back up and then back up reverse and then you jump up, which again is gonna be working your legs and all your squat muscles. And you're trying to do it like as fast as you can and that's gonna be building your cardio and honestly burpees are just awesome. And what I have been told time and time again, and this works with lots of things, not just exercise. What you don't want to do is probably what you need to do and need to work on. So you don't wanna do a burpee, you should probably do some burpees. But these five exercises are like my top favorites, ones that I try to include in my programming, like at least one, 
every single every single session. If you want to learn more about my training in particular, I did film a video about it kind of recently, um, about my whole training split and CrossFit and all the things that I do. So you can go check that video out. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I hope you learned something. I hope you implement these movements into your fitness routine, and I will see you guys next time. Bye. Hey guys, thank you so much for making it to this point in the video. I hope you enjoyed. Please check out the links in the description and support my Patreon if you can. And of course, like and subscribe. New videos every Tuesday, and I will see you guys next time.